Students emerge from Stony Brook, equipped to lead an increasingly complex world and poised to build a better future. Because it's got this very strong reputation, I'm able to attract the very best students who could come to my lab. We supply the tools to help our economically disadvantaged students break out of the constraints of poverty to reach their full potential. There's a recent study from Stanford Institute for Economic Policy Research which showed that a Stony Brook education ranks among the top 10 of all institutions around the country in the ability to take individuals from the lowest quintile of income, the lowest 20% of income, and graduate them up afterwards and help them land in the top 60%. My experience at Stony Brook was everything. It completely changed my life. My intellectual capacity wasn't really tapped into, and Stony Brook tapped into that intellectual capacity. Our new facilities marry cutting-edge technology and comfort. Our goal, nothing less than creating an environment designed to facilitate learning, research, and social bonding. Stony Brook University you know, has recognized the importance of you know, providing students with the resources that they need, um, putting them in an environment where they can attain that next level in their education. We are bringing innovation to improve human health and the ecosystems that they depend on. We nurture students' boundless curiosity and help them to realize possibilities never before imagined. We celebrate that different approach because that is the thing that no one's seen before and that's the thing that catches the eye. Stony Brook firmly believes we're more relevant and effective when we're all inclusive. Look no further than our role as one of 10 University Impact Champions for the He For She Initiative to see that Stony Brook University is committed to bold, game-changing action to achieve equality. By opening conversations about just gender equality in general, that invites people to talk about their experiences and at the end of it, you come out with a better understanding of what it is to be human. My name is uh, Bergius Gaboras. I'm the principal here at Brentwood South Middle School. I started the education program. I want to work with children. I want to make sure that they go on the right path. I want to afford them the opportunity that I got uh, coming out of high school and going into Stony Brook through the OP program. EOP is important because it gives folks like myself an opportunity to get a step ahead. My name is Peter Small, I'm the founding director of Stony Brook University's Global Health Institute. The first thing that makes the Global Health Institute unique is that we go far beyond the campus confines to bring our expertise to global problems. For example, we're using drones to make house calls to remote villagers near the Ranamathan Park in rural Madagascar. This project is really just a pathfinder for much bigger vision about how technology can leapfrog over the challenges that are faced in these remote villages. I'm Liliana Davalos, and I am an associate professor at the Department of Ecology and Evolution at Stony Brook University. We're looking at groups of bats. We get samples from them. We bring them back to the lab, and in the lab, we extract proteins or we extract nucleic acids, so RNA or DNA. And these proteins are critical to understand what are the conditions out there in the environment that make it more likely for a virus to jump over into the human population. The students are intellectual contributors. They are actually bringing the fresh minds to the question. My name is Carrie Lamb Jr. First coming here, I had to find my niche and my place. It's taken some time, but I think I really found it, and I'm really becoming a scholar. Here at Stony Brook, we're finding an incredibly diverse group of students who really want to commit themselves to improving the lives of the global poor. For the STEM fields, the future is already here. More than ever, we need that knowledge, we need that understanding, because ultimately, our very survival depends on making those discoveries. We're passionately committed to the brightest young minds because they are our great hope for tomorrow. With your help, together, we're fashioning a bold new world.